Now let me just give you a picture on what's going what's going on here in Mark chapter 6. And the disciples, they're, they're on a boat in the middle of the ocean. And, and, the, and the waves are crashing in around them. And, and they're just they're scared and they, they think they're going to die and they don't know what to do. And then, they, and then we come to uh, verse 46 and it says, Jesus saw the disciples straining at the oars because the wind was against them. And how many of us, so many times in our life, we just, we're straining at the oars. Jesus almost gives us a picture of us, of someone in a, of, of the disciples in the boat, just straining against the wind, not making any progress. They're just pushing in there. It's almost like they're, they're going backwards. And Jesus says that he sees them. And he says, he almost says, he says, son, daughter, what are you doing? Why are you struggling against that situation? Why are you fighting so hard against the wind? Why are you, why are you straining against the oars? Why, why are you trying to paddle upstream? He just, he just looks at them. He sees them and he almost says like, what, what are you doing? He says, don't you know, don't you know that I paid for that? Don't you know that, that only by my strength can you overcome that? And Jesus says, Jesus says to us that, he says, there's nothing, there's nothing in you, in and of your own strength that could break that addiction. He says, there's nothing in you that could fix that broken relationship. There's nothing in you that could heal that disease. But he says, I can. And he just says, what are you doing? Why, why are you working for bread that doesn't satisfy? And he says, he says, all who are working and, and heavy laden, he says, come to me says come to me he says don't work for those things he says he says son and daughter he says lay down the oars he says stop struggling he says let me help you he says only by my strength can you overcome this thing he says I died for this very purpose he says come to me all who are broken and I will give you rest he says, anyone with anxiety is come, come and cast their anxieties on me. Cast their anxieties on me because I care for you. Because I love you, Jesus says. So many, so many of us today just need to lay down our oars. We just need to stop fighting against the wind. We just need to lay down our struggles. And we need to stop striving for perfection. Because even if we reach perfection, God says even our righteousness is like, dirty rags so what makes us think that we are gonna be saved by grace but then finish this on our own strength we need Jesus in every single stride and every single breath and only by his strength and his Holy Spirit will we be perfected unto righteousness because God says only by his blood are we able to walk by faith and only by his blood can we be righteous before God. He says even on our best days, even on our best deeds, even in our best strength, all we can bring to God is dirty rags. So when God is looking at you today seeing, he's just saying, what are you, what are you doing? Have, have you forgotten the cross? Have you forgotten how you are truly saved? Have you forgotten this? Have, have you laid down the cross to again pick up the law and try to work by works and performance? The Father loves you so much, and He knows that you're going to struggle. He knows that things are going to be messy. He knows that you're not going to have a perfect life. He knows that you're going to need His strength. Because He looked ahead. Before He died on the cross, He looked ahead, and, and He saw all your struggles. He saw everything that you're going to go through. He saw those addictions. He's not surprised at your addictions. He's not surprised that, that there's a pull inside of you. It's called the flesh that, that just desires something that, that God prohibits. But God says, son, son, let me take that. He says, daughter, let me take that. He says, you're never going to do it on your own. You're only going to struggle against the wind. He says, it's only going to push you backwards. He says, the more you try, you're just going to tire yourself out. You're just going to get weary. You're just going to tire yourself out. He says, let me take over. He says, let me take over. I died for that. Let me 
just says today, he just says, come, all who are weary, all who are broken, all who are lost, and just let me give you rest. He says that, that, that I am the good shepherd and I am the one that will lead you out of this, that I am the one who will give you strength. He says, you're never going to do it in and of your own strength. He says, just, just, just come to me.